Why did the two-legged dog come to an abrupt halt? It had two paws. What? What the fuck? The Glen of Amal Terrier is a breed of dog of the Terrier category and one of four Irish Terrier breeds. It is sometimes called the Irish Glen of Amal Terrier or the Wicklow Terrier, and the name of the breed is often shortened by fanciers to just Glen. A big dog on short legs, the Glen of Amal Terrier is an achondroplastic dwarf breed. It is more substantial than might be expected from photographs, a typical adult Glen weighs about 36 pounds and stands 14 inches tall at the withers. The AKC breed standard specifies a height of 12 to 14 inches and a weight of approximately 35 pounds for males and somewhat less for females, with a length to height ratio of 5-3. Many champion Glens are larger than breed standard, with some individuals exceeding 40 or even 45 pounds. With three growth stages, a Glen can take up to four years to reach full maturity. Glens have a large head, with rows or half prick ears, short bowed legs, and a straight top line that rises slightly toward the tail. The shoulders, chest, and hips are sturdy and muscular. On their back, Glens have a unique double coat that is wiry with a soft undercoat. The head, sides, and legs have only the softer coat, which typically develops a degree of waviness. The color of the coat may be Wheaton or blue, the latter usually with brindling, with both Wheaton and blue encompassing a range of shades. Other colorings do occasionally occur in glens, including a mixture of Wheaton and blue referred to as grizzle and a blue and tan that is blue on top with Wheaton furnishings but these rare variations. Glen of Amal Terriers can be energetic and tenacious, but they tend to be more even-tempered, more easygoing, and less vocal than most other terriers. While they love activity, they are not demanding, and are happy to relax by their owner's side. Their bark is deep and authoritative, like that of a much larger dog, and they are said to be good watchdogs. As terriers, glens can have a stubborn streak, but they respond well to a firm hand and can withstand correction when necessary. They are intelligent, learn quickly, and socialize easily. They are typically fearless and loyal, and are superb with people, including children. However, some can be dog aggressive, especially when provoked. Glens often do well at earth dog trials, barn hunt, and in agility. Although not typically strong swimmers due to their short legs and dense body, some glens can work in water, and others have been trained to herd and drive sheep and cattle. The Glen of Amal Terrier has an average lifespan of 10 to 14 years. The typical Glen of Amal Terrier price to expect is around $1,500. If you go the adoption route it will be more affordable likely in the $300 to $500 range. However, it is not unheard of for the Glen of Amal Terrier cost to be as high as $2,000 or even more. Why do dogs tend to run in circles? Because it's really hard to run in squares. Disappointed! Thanks for watching and subscribe for more bad jokes and general knowledge about dogs.